from Ehang. This is our main product it's called Go Strong. So it's a very smart and easy to control uh, consumer level yeah. c consumer I've level uh, drone, and it's controlled by your smartphone. So you don't have to need uh, to learn how to use a uh, remote controller. So just you know download the app from the App Store, and then you can just use it, fly it. Some some, some buttons on the screen. It's really easy. Yeah. Very cool. So what would you say your uh, your marketing strategy has been so far? Well, it's growing in the U.S., but um, we, we will see that we can. It's not comparable with DJI. That's a giant in the drone industry. But uh, we are growing really fast. We just finished our Series B funding, so uh, 42 million dollars. It's really a um, big success, and uh, the, both, the both Chinese team and the, the U.S. team is growing really fast. Yeah. So, uh, what were the challenges you think on bringing the company from the, from China to the United States? So. Um, I think the most difficult part for us is that the marketing in the U.S. is kind of different from the marketing in China. So in China, we have we have all the connections and network in China. It's really easy for us to branding and all the stuff. But in U.S., I think the main market is controlled by DJI. So you know we have to learn how to break the wall. So can you tell us a little bit more about the drone and uh, kind of like the price points and... Okay, yeah, no problem. The price point. Oh. Okay, yeah. so uh, right now I'm holding a pink version, like standard uh, Ghost 1.0, and the price point is $599. And the one Sutong is holding is $799. Yeah, the difference is it has a gimbal, and a gimbal, uh, once you put the GoPro, it's just ready to shoot the videos. So, any plans for VR? Yes, um, I would say that it's not building the current version of the drone, but it's coming. It's coming along.